last year, Bill Gates really put the cat amongst the pigeons when he suggested that robots be taxed as human workers are, so paying the equivalent of social security and income tax. And he made this proposal in response to concerns that an accelerating pace of technological change will create mass unemployment and there'll be a need to create new sources of government revenue to retrain displaced workers. Now, I don't think this is a good idea. Um, the central problem for Western economies in recent years is that productivity growth has been growing at um, below trend rates, we've had a real slowdown in productivity growth. And by contrast, actually, job growth, particularly in economies like the US and the UK, has been very strong. There's been a job boom, but investment has been quite weak. And of course, a robot tax would penalise exactly the productivity enhancing investment we need to kickstart um, productivity. There's also a definitional problem. Um, how do you define when a machine becomes a robot? Um, the UK tax authorities struggled to define whether a Jaffa cake was a biscuit um, or a uh, cake for that purposes. Um, it's a monstrous question trying to work out when a machine becomes a robot. I think the risk with the ro uh, robot tax is you'd end up with um, a lot more low paid, low skilled uh, jobs and um, uh, insufficiency of investment. So for all these reasons I don't think it'll happen um, but I think those who've made the case for robot tax are concerned with good reason about a stagnation in incomes for a lot of lower skilled American workers. That is a real problem but a robot tax isn't the answer.